it's time to get a grip and clean my room get ready for the concert tomorrow i still have to finish studying for finals because i have them next week and then the school year finally ends let me show you like my outfit and everything for the concert today i went to the dollar store and i had to glue on a nail no and there's like dry glue and i don't know how to get it off so i'm wearing this green dress with these white shoes i'm gonna wear this bow and then i'm gonna have curls in my hair so i need to put these in right now i need to feel so bad oh i have like a lot to do before the concert so i'll let you know what time i go to bed <laughs> all right i woke up with a sore throat well actually it started hurting last night and then i took something to just try to fight it off and it didn't work so i made tea hoping that that'll help but let me show you some other things I forgot to show you last night. So here are my bracelets. And I and Bailey is homesick and sounds pretty songs. Here's my sign. I just really woke up way too early because it's literally six. And we have to leave at eight. So I'm gonna pack. I was not awake when I was packing, so I didn't pack enough. And so let me just do Okay, first thing I'm gonna do is take out this. Since I put these in like really lazily last night, so I'm hoping that they actually turn out. I'm gonna go wash my face. Okay, time to do my makeup for the concert. I have a look in mind, and we'll see what happens. Sorry, I don't have like any energy right now. It's six in the morning. Okay. Why is it not working? Okay, first I'm gonna use this health primer. Okay, I need to go wash this off my hands and get this wet in the sink. Okay, so now I'm gonna use this Maybelline concealer and cover my my dark circle. <laughs> I don't have anything to say. Okay, now that it's all blended, I'm gonna take this cover on powder and set the concealer. I need this beauty blender as a, as a powder puff. The garbage truck something. Now, based on all the other makeup videos I've done, it seems like I can't make a good look, but this will be a good look, so don't worry. I'm gonna do my eyes while that's setting. I think I'm gonna use this palette right here. I already have a eyeshadow look in mind. And if I'm doing my makeup in the wrong order, don't even tell me, because I don't care. I'm gonna use this color right here. Wait. Yeah, I am. You can't see it, but I got like a base on there. So now I'm gonna use this color right here. Can you see it? Nope, I see it. Right. I'm gonna blend the colors together with this brush right here. I'm gonna do highlight on the inner corner. Wait. I'm gonna blend that a little bit more so that the colors. So now I'm gonna take this powder brush. Wait, that is not powder brush. Now I'm gonna blend the powder. Good enough. So now I'm gonna take this tart blush and <laughs> using this brush. This is what's gonna fix the look and make it actually look good. I think there's no such thing as too much blush. Okay, you can't really see it because of the lighting, but it's on. I'm gonna do my highlight. Put it on my cheekbones and my nose and brow bones. And keep it low. 
I forgot to do eyeliner. I'm doing it on my waterline. It really doesn't feel like tonight I'm gonna be at a concert. <laughs> Done with my eyeliner. I'm gonna do my mascara. <sighs> you don't need to see it. <laughs> Here's the look. Can you even see? No. Let me see if I can get better lighting. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> I'm gonna do my hair now. I'll try and hide my face. I have this spray. It doesn't really work that well on like heatless curls, but it's all I have, so. Okay, I'm gonna spray these and hope that they actually stay in the sun. They're already kind of uncurling. <coughs> smells horrible. I'm just gonna pull back some pieces in a bow. I'm scared for what this is gonna look like. I just know I might have a mental breakdown, but whatever. I hate how the baby hairs are falling out. And it kind of looks messed up from the spray, but I think I don't care. <laughs> There's the back. I'm gonna go eat like a small snack because I'm so hungry. And then we're gonna get breakfast on the road. <sighs> okay, I also picked up jewelry, so I'm wearing these hoops because who do you think I am? I'm wearing these rings and this necklace has like a pressed flower in it. Okay, I put more pieces back and I actually like how it looks way better. These are not even, but it's none of your business. Just like the back of my head, none of your business. Let me show you. I look so like Madison Beer. Right? <sighs> time to put my jewelry on. And it's almost time to go. Lighting is probably going to be bad this entire video. I'm not going to bring my like ring light and tripod to the concert. Like.
moment was top three might have even been number one. <laughs> it felt so good to be on stage with you, and it feels so good to be back on stage with you now. I love you more! I'm about to go up there
This is like the first time I'm, that I actually have more energy when I'm talking to you because I filmed in the morning and at night only. But I thought to end this video I would tell you kind of all of the events that happened at the concert because it was just a long day and there were like a lot of things that happened. We got there at 1.30 and by the way the doors opened at like 6 so we waited in line for so long. So we ordered food and from Grubhub and then we got brought food from a completely different restaurant and it was like goop and glob and huh? we were offering it to other people. I feel bad because it literally looked poisonous but we gave it to the people behind us we were like do you guys want food there was like a homeless family across the street so we gave it to them but i feel bad because it was like disgusting if we gave them other food later i'll tell you what happens we kept like talking to those girls in line they were holding our spot in line whenever we would like leave to go sit in the shade because we were in the sun and it was really hot so then we ordered different food from grubhub and it actually got there and so we Slay! ate and we bought the two girls behind us waters one of the like staff members saw me and he was like you Come here. He said that I looked unwell. He was like, you're turn you're really red and like, you look like you need water. I went to the pub and I drank some water and put sunscreen on. I just waited in there for a while and cooled down. And one of the people working there was like, if you spend $15 a person, you can skip the line, the general admission line. So we were like, okay, let's do that. But then we invited the girls that we like bought waters for everything we invited them to come with us i was not hungry at all because we had just eaten so then we each ordered pizza i ate like one slice and boxed it up because i was not hungry we gave them away to people online and then we gave the pizza to the homeless family across the street because we were like we're not going to make them eat that slime like that is criminal we waited in line more and then we went inside we waited for the concert to start and this girl was so rude. She pushed her way to the front of the line. My older sister was like, we were here first. Like, and she was like being so rude. She was like, oh, sorry. Like I moved over for one person and guess how many of us there are? One, two, three, four. She sat like this the whole time. You're, going, you're seeing Madison beer and you're not gonna move a muscle. Like the only words I saw her sing were part of the chorus of Selfish. I'm like, you're pushing your way to the front and you don't even know her songs and you're like, not even letting yourself have fun. There's people in the back who actually know, who actually want to be there. And she left early. So there were two openers and I thought, the second one that came on, I thought it was Madison Beer. I was like, oh, there's, there's another one. We met the other, the second opener and she was really sweet. I literally limped my way outside because I was in so much pain. Oh, another person pushed to the front and her, she had a sash that said birthday princess. I'm like, just because you're the birthday princess doesn't mean you get to push away to the front. I'm just so pissed off. And then the gays, they helped us. My older sister was like, make sure you give her an extra puff, an, an extra shove when you walk by. And he literally was like, skis me, like push. It was so, it was honestly so iconic. And we got followed back to a hotel room by a man who was creepy. But we made it back safely and the hotel was really nice and then here we are thanks for watching this vlog i hope you enjoyed it sorry like i didn't have any energy for most of it this is my last video until summer finally it literally took so long and this year this school year was atrocious anyways So actually that song says nothing about the 1960s.